The NFL training camp's about a month away. This is the time of the year when a lot of the local players held, held their youth football camps. Atlanta Falcons linebacker Leroy Reynolds from Norfolk has been holding camps for years. His free camp gets underway tomorrow morning at Palatine Field in Norfolk. Nathan Epstein recently caught up with Reynolds to talk about his career and that Super Sunday in February when he came oh so close to winning it all. I've always believed that I was going to make it to the NFL. I didn't know how I was going to do it, but I just believed and trusted that I was going to make it. That belief, trust, and perseverance paid off for Norfolk's own Leroy Reynolds. Couldn't unfold it any better. The Maury High School standout turned University of Virginia star linebacker went undrafted in 2013. Then he was signed and dropped by the Jacksonville Jaguars and the Chicago Bears before finally settling in on special teams with the Atlanta Falcons. I was able to be me. I was able to have fun and, and really bring a lot of energy and passion to it. So the guys fed off. Who would have thought just a few months ago this humble Norfolk native would end up on football's biggest stage? You always watch the Super Bowl and you, you see the first kickoff, you see all the cameras flashing. Like watching it from home, you see it, and then like being there and just like, oh, this is really happening. I still remember where my parents sat. Like I still remember the turf. Like it was the best field I ever like played on. It felt fast. I felt great. My body felt great. And in the third quarter against the Patriots, the former Commodore made his mark, recovering an onside kick for the Falcons. I was grateful to be able to have that moment um, for my friends, for my family. I mean, for the city. Um, it was big. Like, I didn't expect it, but I'm glad it happened that way. For Reynolds, this offseason has been about taking the next step. I can only control what I do, you know, uh, the effort that I put in, the work that I put in. You know, and how much I'm really putting into being the best football player, be the best person I can be. So for me, just trusting that process and understanding that it'll all come into its own. He calls himself a dog. He's certainly hungry for more. In Norfolk, Nathan Epstein for the Sports Rap. All right, thank you, Nathan. Chicago Bears defensive back B.W. Webb, he's from Newport News, and he spent today giving back. He was at the Virginia Peninsula Food Bank in Hampton, and then he went to the Towers and Circles Mobile Home Park in Newport News, and he was delivering prepared hot meals to children. Webb also has a football camp scheduled for tomorrow. It's the Seven Cities Football Camp at Woodside High School. That camp is free. Look at her. How cool is that?